This video is an introduction of the Department of Environmental and Bioresource Sciences. In the video, there will be an explanation of the five fields of study, and you will see keywords that relate to each field. Please choose one of the fields introduced, and write an essay detailing your interest and knowledge of the field. Please keep in mind that you must use at least two of the keywords that appear at the end of the section for the field that you selected, and that you must watch the video until the very end. Remember, you only need to compose one essay on the topic of one field in the department of your interest. At KUAS, the Faculty of Bioenvironmental Sciences encompasses three key areas of study. Ecology and Environment. Agriculture and Food Technology and biotechnology. These areas, when combined, form the departments of environmental and bioresource sciences, and applied biological sciences. Under the Department of Environmental and Bioresource Sciences, there are five different fields of study. Ecology, Water Environment, Bioresource Management, Agricultural Production, and Regional Collaboration. Our well-being relies on the ecosystem and its derived goods and services. Addressing ecosystem degradation requires our action to mitigate human-induced effects. In this research field, we aim to study local ecological features and address environmental challenges. In this field, students will learn about animal ecology, environmental education, and landscape ecology. Students will explore different ecological interactions, such as plant-animal, prey-predator, and competition dynamics. They will also utilize DNA analysis to reveal genetic traits crucial for ecological study and conservation efforts. Natural environments offer diverse resources, even in human-managed areas like rice paddy fields. These fields serve as fishery ground for human and habitats for fish-eating birds such as storks, ibises, and egrets. Environmental education enhances awareness of the ecological roles that these habitats. Understanding ecosystems at broader spatial scales is vital. By analyzing the elements of a landscape in spatial patterns, students will examine how the structure and function of an environment corresponds to social changes. Research findings will inform proposals for sustainable natural capital management. In the realm of water environment, you will learn to evaluate the physical chemical and biological conditions of various water bodies to protect and preserve the aquatic environment and its inhabitants. Given the context of global climate change, let's scientifically unravel the mysteries of the water environment around us. Join us and immerse yourself in the beauty of the water environment. We conduct sampling in diverse areas, such as rice paddy fields, ponds, rivers, as well as coastal oceans of Japan and across Asia. In this field, you will study aquatic ecosystem, water quality analysis, and environmental management. Aquatic biodiversity stands as a crucial focus. You will explore ecological and evolutionary biological perspectives including plankton community assessment through environmental DNA techniques. Moreover, you will concentrate on chemical analysis and address the pressing global issue of plastic debris and microplastics in the aquatic environment. Lastly, you will emphasize the application and integration of AI, GIS, and remote sensing, coupled with IoT systems, for environmental management. In the field of bioresource management, you will explore how to use the bioresources around us in a sustainable manner, creating balance between the livelihoods of people and the conservation of biodiversity. Gain insight into pressing global environmental issues like carbon emissions and land degradation as we embark on this journey together. Have fun while you learn, conducting research in natural forests, farmlands, and sequoia landscapes. 
you are encouraged to explore these environments and bring back samples for experiments. Revel in the natural beauty surrounding our campus and participate in study tours both domestically and internationally. In this field, you'll expand your understanding of biomass utilization. Regenerative forest management and sustainable agroecosystem. To achieve sustainability, it's essential to strike a balance between biomass conservation and consumption. You'll acquire knowledge in estimating carbon stocks using conventional techniques, remote sensing and GIS. You will also deepen your knowledge in wood science and technology for biomass utilization, especially the application of carbonization and biochemical processing. Additionally, you will learn from indigenous knowledge to explore modern forest management systems that improve biodiversity. Shifting cultivation is one of the best examples. Also, you will focus on soil conservation and improvement using diverse bioresources such as bamboo or agricultural residues for building a sustainable agroecosystem. In the field of agricultural production, based on social demands, you will learn to characterize vegetables and field crops agronomically and genetically, to optimize growth conditions and develop new varieties. Additionally, you will gain insight into farm management from a business perspective. Join us and delve into the wonders of agriculture. We cultivate Kyoto's traditional and innovative vegetables and crops in the fields and greenhouses on our campus. To gain first-hand experience in agriculture, we regularly visit farmers in urban and rural areas for sampling and surveys. In this field, you will study plant breeding and genetics, vegetable and field crop cultivation, and farm management, enhancing crop quality and yield through the development of new variety stands as a pivotal objective. You will learn techniques for generating genetic variation and selecting superior genotypes, employing various phenotyping and genotyping methods, including DNA analysis. Moreover, your focus will extend to sustainable agriculture, such as recirculated hydroponic culture in greenhouses, aiming to mitigate autotoxicity, which is a type of growth inhibition due to chemicals from plant roots themselves. Emphasizing the maximization of benefits utilizing local resources, including novel varieties and technologies, you will analyze the food system from production to consumption employing social scientific approaches. In this field, we will build on the basic and applied studies and research in the four fields described earlier, which are ecology, water environment, bioresource management, and agricultural production. We work with the community to develop more practical and local applications. Therefore, it is vital to work with the local community without relying on literature. We need to understand the local and diverse issues, as well as effectively applying our research to tackle the said issues. For example, in the field of ecology, we consider the promotion of environmentally friendly agriculture through workshops with local residents. We teach the impact of chemical pesticides to the crops, fisheries, and other modern agricultural methods on rural ecosystems. This helps to raise their environmental awareness. In the field of water environment, we collaborate with Kamioka City to study river pollution via monitoring surveys and recommend measures for effective litter control. In the field of bioresource management, in collaboration with Kamioka City and other universities, we have established a system that allows farmers to apply carbonized biomass from the community to farmland and produce value-added agricultural products. This aids in climate change mitigation and preserves Kamioka's environment. Moreover, in the field of agricultural production, we have developed locally adapted Kamamaruimo white yams from tropical roots as a Kamioka speciality. Our ongoing efforts include enhancing its variety, expanding production, and broadening sales channels in collaboration with local farmers.